episode of Crazy Town Gaming, where we are the voice inside your head. I'm Jonas. And I'm TNT Dynamite, and we have a very special guest with us this week. The illustrious, the industrious, the uncrustiest man I've ever met in my life. Straight from the heart of the TEX. More than a Tex-Mex, more than the rest. Little bit more than what you would thought before. The man, the myth, the legend, Mr. X. Mr. X. That, that has to be one of the most fantastic intros i can you actually record send me a recording of that all text <laughs> sure. no ass mr <laughs> all text, no ass. i like that actually. Sorry. all text no ass all right <laughs> so mr look, x look we, we i appreciate jo- text. jonas has actually written my theme song which I, he sings <laughs> I it often which i appreciate i'm like I have, a, I have a theme song it's good you should just go by mr tex now mr tex mr yeah. tex no, 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 all text, no ass. It's Mr. All text, no ass. All right, so we are back at uh, oh. Lookout Landing. Oh, there's lots of dumb people for you to vote. What did now. we do last episode, Jones? We had uh, last episode we went to uh, we Gannon. Yeah, we we didn't Gannon necessarily. We we will meet Gannon. We went to Hyrule Castle and we defeated the Throne Room battle, which was one of the hardest battles I've encountered so far in this entire game. And now we're back to talk to Pura so, about the next step. So we are in game are, right now. Are, are you near the end of the game? We here? are very near the oh, end. Oh, yeah. Are you going to win this if there's a thing? You want to do a voice, by oh, the sure. way? It, you know, who, who, who you guys? Oh, sure. Who is this? This is Pura. 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 So you have to do a nice, feminine, sexy. Get, make it sexy. Pura. Right. Okay. Make it sexy. Make se- uh, well, I, I, I'm going to, you know, I'll, I'll, uh, I'll interpret it as I will if you don't mind. Right, well, me. if I don't get a boner, mm-hmm. I'm going to be angry. Well, that, that That's shouldn't be a problem. Scary. Welcome back. Uh, Looks like it was pretty tough. So how did it go? Cutscene. Um, you know what? Honestly, I'm half masked. I'm half masked. I see. So oh, you cut, you gotta cut my lines off. There's no mistaking that what you all saw at the castle was the Demon King from the legend of the Imprisoning War, and the princess you've been seeing was actually an imposter. And the reason she appeared at Hyrule Castle was so the Demon King could lure Link into a trap. I knew something seemed weird. No, oh, that's the wrong person. Yeah, I'll do, I'll do awesome. him. I knew something was seemed weird. I oh, mean, the Princess late. Zelda was not doing anything to help those troubles out, else, everywhere in Hyrule. <laughs> but it's all connected. It, the upheaval, the problems with the homelands have been facing the fake princess. It's all happening because the Demon King came back. Has Tulane been drinking? Oh, so, so, go so, ahead. That, so then that means the Princess Zelda isn't actually here. <laughs> That's not his voice, but I love it, dude. Keep Instead, she's in a distant past and not in the present, right? Hmm. Yes, we should consider that to be the case, Bazaar's sounds. It also seems that Princess Zelda was trying somehow to defeat the Demon King in the past. Hmm. Our ancestors made a vow that to Zelda. They swore that when the Demon King was revived, their descendants would awaken as sages and fight alongside Link. I hate this. But the Princess Zelda in the past, we can uh, wait for her in plain and suppose, <laughs> yeah, whatever. Shut up, Tulin. Nobody cares. Go ahead. <laughs> we also don't know anything about the Demon King other than the fact that he's bad news and super strong. What do we do? Ah. Hmm. Based on what you have told me, (laughs) it appears the princess was making preparations in anticipation for the Demon (laughs) King's revival in this era. That makes sense, honestly. We did an era tour here. Oh, she Taylor Swift? I think so. There must be some hint we still haven't figured out here in our time. Hmm. I don't know about that's, you. That's Jonas. Oh, right you are. We can't afford to stand still at this time such as this. This is imperative that we act. I think its voice changed from the last time yep. you did it. Absolutely. Hmm, but without any leads. Sure, so did hers. Hmm. Yep. Oh, wait. <laughs> you said the six ages were the King Raru when he fought against the Demon King during the Imprisoning War, right? Is this right? the story of Naruto? 
I don't know what the fuck this is. Wind! Wind! That was me! Fire! Water! Water! Still and lightning! lightning. <laughs> Captain Planet! <laughs> and time! And time! This was the princess! Oh! Wow. I see! Oh, I huh? hate this. Well, what is it? What do you see? That's it! There was one more sage back then! Oh. There was another sage. Uh oh. Better find a secret sage. Dude, I thought there was. I thought we were done. It's secret Santa time. Oh, here it is. Jingle bells all the way. Is that a cat? This is new to me, honestly. <laughs> exactly. One more sage that might be here now. I'm losing that, actually, you now. I'm sure this is the lead we were hoping for. It will be well worth our while to search. Yeah, it's gone. I'm soft. <laughs> Each of you <laughs> oh my God. the sages at ruins from the Age of Legends, right? Maybe the remaining sage is in a similar location. So we got, like, a mystery <laughs> sage? <laughs> that makes sense. So we should uh, search major ruins from the <laughs> Age of Legends. <laughs> They, they say a good place as any to start. If if we just searched all of Hyrule randomly, we'd probably never find the same. Yeah, man, we just need to play more reggae. All right, we have a plan. Let's split up the work and get to it. Yeah. You four, go back to your homelands. And that's kind of racist. And gather <laughs> information about ruins that might be related to the remaining sage. All right. Linky, search around and see if you can find my clear. Find any <laughs> other undiscovered leads. What? No one found that. <laughs> Everyone relying on you. Don't let us down. Yeah, check the rule 34. Plenty of people <laughs> yep. have found that. You're a person. Yeah. <laughs> oh, she a popular 34? Uh, yeah. Yeah. So popular. No, I mean any Wait, female what? in a video game, people are gonna draw. They're gonna find their. Star. Oh, are there people what drawing sexual things about Puras? Level yeah. thirty four. All right, so I have to I have to talk to her again. So get ready. Okay. <gasps> we have to protect Hyrule, no matter what. Princess Zelda wanted that. <laughs> She's like a weathered war veteran. <laughs> it's kind she of an odd, it's kind of an Audrey Hepburn. Okay. But the Demon King's power is the force that to be reckoned with. So for now, we need to search for the fifth sage. Hell yeah, we do. Following the upheaval, I mobilized the Zonai survey team because surveying is fun and investigated ruins connected with the Zonai. But so far, we found nothing but the fifth about the fifth sage. There must be some clue hiding out there that we haven't found yet. I can feel it. Can you feel me? <laughs> so King Rauru and the six sages fought the demon king in the imprisoning war. <laughs> Princess Zelda was one of those people, the sage of time. <laughs> There were five sages we know of. Wind, fire, water, lightning, and time. That leaves one more. There must be a clue to all this somewhere. I think it's worth revisiting the ruins from the land, the Age of Legends to see what we can find. Bro, I don't know where that is. I don't know where that is, though. So you guess what? We get to figure it out get now. Get to jump off a roof. Mean? No, what do you mean? Stupid tooling. Age of Legends, right? So, okay. So the only thing I can think of is to go back to the ruins where I started the game. That is the only thing that honestly makes any sense. Oh, to me. I think that's what I was last here. <laughs> it might have been. It, it was very early in the game when you were here. But I don't remember where any of that is either, to be honest. Room of Awakening. That's probably it. <laughs> I mean, all right, let's go to the Room of Awakening. I'll like, take you to my room, room of Awakening. <laughs> Honestly, look, I just want everybody to give it up for Mr. X. Thank you. Yay. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank it felt you. like Grandma was here. I, I feel like I earned my paycheck today. Yep, yep, yep. Yep. Your free coupon to the buffet down the street. That's right. He did not maintain my erection, but he did a wonderful job of uh, dictation. It was all ass, no text. He did. Oh. He did a lot of dictation. 
That's but, a great but not enough dick titillation, apparently, right? Oh, hey, no. hey, <laughs> oh, oh, it's a guy, dude. Talk no, to the hell is that? that guy, is that a floating pillow? No, <laughs> is that a floating it's, pillow? A, it's a stupid. Yeah, we are, <laughs> bye bye. We already got his his coin. He gives us a little coin if we do a little task for him. It's a little kitty game you play. Little dan- what is that thing following you around? These are too my. Late. <laughs> That's too late. Is it shooting at you or it's is it the, following? It's you? the same four guys that were sitting there, but it's their ghost form. Oh. Not really ghost, but some sort of. Yeah. Oh, yeah, I see the fat guy back there. Yeah. So, yeah hey, he's big bone, bro. They follow me around. I can use them for, like attacks and stuff. Okay. 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 They're cool. They're cool. Either way, look, we, we got to figure out what the hell I got to do here. Is there a marker on the map at all? Uh, there is, but the marker on the map takes us straight to Pura. That's why I spoke to her again and tried to get more information from her. But I don't really know if it's the, well, the legends thing, right? Isn't that what she said? Yeah, she said the ruins of legend. But the like, this is the only thing I can think of right now that <laughs> makes me think of ruins of legend. So I don't know. I can't really think of anything else. So how do you know if you're doing the right thing in these games? We, I, you, you don't really know, but it's it's an open open world game, so you kind of just go where you where you go. Yeah. As a reminder to legions of fans of Crazy Town Gaming, I, I don't know anything about gaming. So. No, and you haven't been here for like you know 50 episodes. It's or been so. a hot minute. Yeah. So we're There's we're some, pretty yeah. deep. We're pretty deep into it There's right some now. Ducks. Okay. Right, I'm gonna go back up here and we'll check this island out because this is where we started and that's why it makes me think of ruins of i if i was gonna think really hard about it yeah uh we should probably go to the kakariko village i think that has something to do with it i remember hearing earlier in the game that is so clairvoyant of you i am shocked that you were able to just think through that yeah kakariko village that's impressive okay Okay. i think it might be um a really long journey that we're about you to know go on. it's very funny because between episodes i did do some extras and i've actually illuminated a lot of map Aww, and i've got a thanks. lot of waypoints and in my travels i actually uh i actually stumbled so, up on kakariko village. so we need to go to the cock ring village is that yeah. right yeah yeah so. the cock ring village we'll, go. we'll be there next that's all the time we have today's episode see you on the next one the cock ring village for jonas tnt and mr x we have